Elizabeth Warren has a lot riding on New Hampshire. She's campaigned extensively here over the last year, and she needs a strong finish, if not an outright victory, to help get her campaign back on the upswing. Wrapping up a grueling campaign weekend in the Upper Valley, Elizabeth Warren told voters she's taken on the best and brightest of a lot of her former competitors in the 2020 primary. When other people dropped out of this race, I already talked to them and pulled their ideas, some of their campaign staffers, and ultimately a lot of their volunteers into my campaign. But now there are questions about just how long the Massachusetts senator will be able to hold out if she doesn't win over voters here in New Hampshire. In a news conference in Concord, she told reporters she's in this race to go the distance. It looks like it is going to be a long battle to the nomination. Uh, we have already built out offices and have on the ground troops in 30 states. Warren will wrap up her first in the nation campaign on Monday with a get out the vote event in Rochester and a town hall in Portsmouth. In the studio, Adam Sexton, WMUR News 9.